Hello, puppies. Oh my goodness, you guys ready to play? Are you ready to do some of your training? All right, we got Charlie, Maggie, Gracie. We'll go over everybody's new names today. Come on, Odie. Oh, who's not gonna come? <laughs> what are you doing over there, Nyla? It's Miss Teal. She always makes me come get her. <laughs> oh, you guys are doing so good with your potty training. This is Miss Nyla, little teal collar. And you guys might be wondering, why are they all together? So, when Bodie went home last week, um, Oakley's puppies backtracked a ton on their potty training. And I was like, no, no, we cannot have this. So I decided to combine the litters because it made everybody just start to use those potty trays again. There's less um, space for them to start pottying all the places that they're not, and they are all doing superb again. They didn't have one accident last night um, into this morning when I did my morning cleaning. And so they did so good. So everybody is super happy together. Um, and I think they just like it. I think they like having a ton of puppies to play with and, and they just like being together. All right, puppies, let's get your toys out and our potty trays out. So let's put these where you guys will actually use them. Put two out. It's also a, a fun thing for them to climb on. There we go. Hopefully, if we have those out, then they will go on those and not everywhere else in the garage. They love, they love the free things. <laughs> Paper towel roll, bag, bless you. All right, we get a few things out, that way they can do stuff while I'm doing the stairs. Hey, one, con one contender's going. They love stuff that they can hold in their mouth and drag around with them. The latest thing that I have found that they loved was um, we drink protein shakes, and so the shaker cups, like the little, the scooper, they um, have been really loving on those lately. <laughs> but I can't leave those in their area with them. It's too, they're too small, so it's gotta be a, a supervised toy. All right, friends, who's gonna do the stairs first? Come here. Are you ready to try the stairs? Let's go, let's do it. Guys, I am so thankful that I have these puppies out here that I can come out and play with them because it's been a little bit of a stressful week. I have gone through Business 101 and had to learn a lot about um, manufacturing and shipping and just, that was one way to come down the stairs, Odie. Um, but just all sorts of things that I had no idea about. Um, and I am so thankful for these guys. Hey, good job, Charlie, because I have been able to like have a little bit of a stressful situation, but then come in here and do what I know how to do. I know how to raise puppies and I know how to play with them. And it's just been very comforting. Um, so first of all, like when we uh, said that we wanted to do these puppy trays, I had no idea how long it took to create something. Um, we had to do prototypes. We had to buy a mold uh, for the for the potty trays, that the bottom piece of the tray. We had to get a mold, and that was like thousands of dollars. Um, and that was just that's just one part of it. We had to do the prototypes. That cost money to do. Uh, so using our savings to buy these items is definitely um, a challenge mentally to, to believe in a product so much, but then to have, uh, to have the gumption to kind of like pull the trigger, to make it happen. That, is, that was kind of a big challenge for me and JP, and we, just had, we decided we were gonna go for it. We know this product can help a lot of people. We have woken up to emails. Hey, Odie, you can do it, come on. Here, we'll work on this, this step. There you go. Uh, we have woken up to emails from people, there you go, that are fostering dogs, that are having puppies, and, um, and needed help with this pottying situation. We have had people wake up, uh, or we've had people email us, oh, come here. No, you can't go away now, come back. 
Come on. There you go. Did I get your arm? I'm sorry. We have had people express that they would like to use this uh, for uh, like their high rise, you know, like they live in an apartment and they want to make sure that they have um, a solution for the winter so they don't have to take their dog out in the snow. So we know that this can help a lot of people. We just have to be able um, to get it to them. We want to be able to provide them with the solution. So we're like, we're just super excited about that. But comparing us to a big manufacturer like Walmart, they can sell their product for so much less because they buy millions of them. We thought it was crazy that we had to buy a thousand of them. Um, but it's just, we're just hoping to break even. Like that is what we, that's our first goal for this business um, is to break even. So it's, it's a lot. Um, but I, I, again, I just come back in here when I'm having a challenging day and I just play with my sweet little puppies and remind myself that it's all going to work, that we're going to be able to get this and make it successful. All right, it's, it's king of the mountain time. You can see they just love playing on this thing. But Oakley's family, they got, their puppies got introduced, and I'm going to tell you, Bella Grace's families were a little upset that their puppies didn't get their uh, feature on the, on the film because they, some of them had given me names, and I did not introduce them. So I want to take the time this week to tell everybody about them. So the first one is Miss Green, or Mr. Green, it's Renix. And she is super sweet. She's going to a family with two other dogs. <laughs> All right, who else we got? Hey, come here. That's Nyla. Come here. There we go. Miss Teal, our little petite one. That's Nyla. And their families were so funny. I think they were just a little jealous. I think somebody has peed on the mountain. Hold on. Somebody must have gotten excited. There we go. Okay, back in action. Okay, I found two more. All right. Oh, Mr. Blue, he actually does not have a name yet, but that's okay. The, the Kendricks will come up with a name soon. They just want to meet him and be with him. And then this is Odie. This is Mr. Black. He is super sweet. Their own, his owner is very happy. Nope, that's red. We're missing orange. Who's behind me? Nope, nope, that's Nyla again. Oh, I think she's wrestling over here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Feisty little lady. This is Miss Orange. This is Palmer. <laughs> I love when they get into the stage. They are all just energy and just super happy. They just run, 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 run. You hear of doodles getting the zoomies? Well, this is, this is definitely it when they run in circles and they do so good, they just do funny things. <laughs> but see, they have that, that shaker cup. <laughs> Other really exciting news is that we confirmed that Rue and Maya are pregnant this week. So that was fun. So one is a mini, one is a medium. Um, and then it just proves uh, that Nipsey, our stud, is, um, is successful. So that was very exciting news this week. And then the other really fun things that we're doing this week is they get to work on their manding and they're gonna work on crate training. So they have been doing a great job settling. So after I clean their area, we've done all of our playtime and then I have to mop, which you guys have seen before. Um, <laughs> But I put them back in their area, um, and they have done a great job settling down and just laying and being quiet while I'm still in here, which is huge. Um, because we want, their, we want them to go home and be able to be in a safe space and their families be able to walk by without them yelping, without them crying out. Um, they need to be secure and independent. So that is like step one of that direction. The next thing is going and actually putting them in the crate and being able to um, start being able to um, tolerate. And our goal is to usually get up to about two hours. <laughs> Are you guys wrestling? Come here, mister. 
what are you doing? <laughs> it's so funny how they can wrestle, 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 and then they're like, I'm just a baby. So these guys are gonna go back in, and then I'm gonna take Bella on a walk because she is our only mom dog here right now. I guess in her case, she's our grandma. Um, so she's the only one here, so she gets so much love and attention, and we go on a lot of walks. <laughs> so we're gonna go do that. Have a wonderful day.